Hey guys, me again. You know what is this? This little guys. It's actually and uh, they contain a silver. You can find him on this old board. And uh, now I don't have too much of them, but I will think. I think that I got enough for some sample. To just recover some of silver and to see how much yield got from this. Okay. So I'm gonna remove that device. Very easy. I'm gonna put that on scale and try to recover some silver, okay? Okay. This is empty cup. We are on zero and we got 20 gram. 20 gram, okay? Now we're gonna crush them with the rice. We're gonna open it and uh, collect silver, okay? Just take rice and uh, crush him like this one. Take rice and one half. See? You expose all that silver inside. Hey guys, here are our bones. I got some distillated water, only 50 milliliter. Now I'm gonna add. Oh, it's a very strong reaction. Now I add nitric acid. But not all amount, just third. So I'm gonna add all nitric acid and I'm gonna leave that for maybe uh, 20 minutes to see what happens, okay? Okay guys, after almost all night, I left that solution in that glass and uh, here, it, here is our silver solution, nitric acid with silver, we start filtration and this is what, we le what is left, only this, I don't know, this material is kind of ceramic and uh, that uh, plastic foils which hold that little silver foils, so everything, no more metal inside, everything is dissolved, see that? So when the filtration stop, we will just drop that silver, okay? So we got here kitchen salt dissolved in water. I got a lot of solution here because I washed that many times and uh, but never mind. Uh, we actually don't got too much silver in there.
So I'm not satisfied. Not at all. We got some super chloride, but I'm not satisfied with this. This is uh, from our dead fuse and already start to settle down. We're gonna leave that till tomorrow. But here, no, not too much. Never mind, we're gonna leave that. Okay guys, so after all, we have some silver chloride, but it's small amount, I expect more. It's look like some other metal is in that little bones, so see how solution is green. Hey guys, what's up? I just do some reverse electroplating. This stuff, and uh, I got a couple of stuff here. It's a very good plating here on that screws. See that? And this is actually aluminium. So, I just want to share with you. Yeah, you can see that. It just looks cool, so I want to share with you. See that? And it's done. And nothing happens. Why is that? So is that actually this is full plated aluminium and uh, this reverse electroplating don't actually affect on this. Why? I don't know. Really. Let's try. Let's try with that screws again. It's working. So why? we can't do reverse electroplating on aluminium. I got one smaller here. And it's that. Nope. Nothing happens. See? Let's turn on. Nothing happens. So, now I expect your message, your comments, why we can do reverse electroplating on aluminium, well plated aluminium. Bye guys.